Hey y'all, what's up? My name is Sonali. Welcome to my new apartment. Me and my boyfriend Ryan actually just moved from Riverside over to the east side here in Austin, Texas. So I wanted to show you guys around before we kind of move everything in. We've like slowly started moving in like the pantry stuff and everything like that, but the movers are coming tomorrow and we got the whole place painted white. I just feel like it makes everything look a little bit more brighter and bigger. But before we see the whole apartment, I did want to give a huge shout out to today's sponsor, which is Smart City ATX. They've been helping me through this whole apartment touring series. Smart City is a free apartment locator service. So basically I gave them all my criteria for what I wanted in an apartment, which was a white kitchen, good lighting in the unit, a lot of like cool amenities. And they gave me a personalized list of apartments to look at and they set up tours for me. So basically all I had to do was the fun part, which was tour the place. You're probably wondering why this service is free and like how do they get paid? So once you sign on your apartment, the local licensed real estate agent actually gets a commission from the apartment you sign at. Even if you guys aren't moving within the Austin area, they operate in many major cities like Dallas, Houston, Austin, San Antonio, Atlanta, Denver, and Nashville. There will be more information in my description as well as a link to get in contact with a local licensed real estate agent so you can start your apartment touring process. Let's get started. I wanna show you guys everything. It is a two bedroom, two bathroom. I believe it's like around a thousand square feet. So we are losing like a bit of space. Um, and you'll kind of see that um, throughout and I'll also link down my last apartment tour in case you wanted to see the difference but first when you walk in you have the kitchen to the side so we have white cabinets which is what I really wanted and we have a gray countertop which I wish it was white but you know we'll deal it's still beautiful right over here we have a farmhouse sink so there's no divider, which is gonna be great. Sophie's gonna love this, this is her new bath. But also for dishes, like it's just really nice to not have a divider. And um, the appliances are all this like matte black kind of situation, which is so nice and very like new, I feel like. That is not something our last apartment had, so I really like that. Um, we have an electric stove over here. We are the first ones that are gonna be living here in this unit, um, so it's really exciting getting to like use everything for the first time. Um, so we have a lot of like cabinetry. I feel like our other kitchen is a little bit like shorter and there's not that much cabinets. Over here is our tiny pantry. It is super, super small. We need to figure out a lot of like the organization because we are, like I said, losing a little bit of space, but it does have like random storage in like the bathroom and obviously the kitchen, we like don't have enough to fill in the kitchen, but you know, we could probably use like another closet or so. Um, but going into the guest bathroom. So this is what I mean by there's like a lot of storage right here. And as you can see, they have like the really nice updated like faucets and everything. I really like the black um, hardware. And then here is the bathtub and the stand up shower, which is super nice. I love the subway tile and I'm definitely going to be taking baths in here, even though I'm not really a bath gal. Right next to the guest bathroom is the guest bedroom. This is going to be my office slash filming room and whatever else we want to make it. And this actually has a smaller closet. So in our old apartment, we had pretty much the same size closets. And now this is going to be Ryan's closet because I just need the bigger one, you know? Missed uh, your closet space. <laughs> no. Um, so it's, it's really not a bad size closet, um, but there is like random like overlapping which like, I don't really understand. Can you see that it's like overlapping on this? So we're just gonna have to figure out the storage, like I said, um, but I'm really excited to just have like white doors and like white walls. Oh, <laughs> there we go. Uh, because our last place had just beige doors and it just like did not look the best. So you're coming out of the guest bedroom, going back into the kitchen area. This is our living room, which I feel like is really big. Um, our last apartment was very like a different layout. So the kitchen was here and then the living room was here and the TV was actually there. So it's definitely a more like confined space, but it's also like pretty big. Um, you guys know we have that big white sectional. I don't even think it's gonna take up this whole wall. So we might put like a table over here then the sectional and then like another table. I don't know what we're thinking. I really wanted like an accent chair. So once we bring in the couch, we can like assess how much space we have. I definitely want to get a rug. Also, if you guys notice, we have hardwoods. And our last place had like all carpet. Um, the bedrooms do have carpet, but 
we do have hardwoods in the living room, so it's really exciting. Um, let's finish off this area. So over here is the washer and dryer, which like, I wish there was like space to put at least detergent and like the dryer sheets, but there's not. Again, we're gonna have to figure that out. But here is a closet. So this is like a storage closet, coat rack kind of thing. I'm thinking of just like putting some cubby kind of things and like being really organized over here and then you put like detergent and all that fun stuff in there. And now it is time for the master bedroom. So honestly, the bedrooms in here are a good bit smaller than our last apartment, but it's not a bad size. This is definitely a little bit bigger than the guest room. Um, so we do have a king bed. So it's gonna be interesting to see how much space we have to walk around because I just bought a dresser to put over there. So shall be interesting. The painters actually took off the blinds to like paint around. They were like, honestly, just keep them off because then that's just like more lighting. And I'm really thankful that Ryan's not one of those guys that just like wants to like blackout curtains. Walking into our master bathroom, we got the double vanities. When I was looking for apartments, I was really wanting this whole situation because this is what me and Ryan have currently and it just works for us. When he has to trim his beard, he does it in his sink. When I wash my orange makeup off at night, it is in my sink, you know, so it just works. Um, but I want you guys to see this beautiful shower. Our shower now is like a literal box. It's so tiny, so we have so much room to just like shave, <laughs> which is nice. I wish there was like a little bench here and like more space for like shampoo, but I guess we do have like a shower caddy. I want to get a new one, so. We'll see what Amazon has to offer. But over here is a linen closet, which has some stuff, because like I said, we've already started moving slowly in. And I think Ryan's gonna take over this and have it as his like second closet, um, because we don't really have that many linens. <laughs> we have like towels, but that's about it. Um, but that's gonna be nice for storage. And then we are walking into my closet, which I've already put a good bit of stuff in. Um, it is a walk-in closet. It has some built-ins over here, so I just kind of have to decide what's going to go there. In our last apartment, the closet that I have is a literal, like, bathroom, a bigger than a bathroom, and it's, like, very full, so this is definitely cutting it in half, <laughs> so I'm going to have to get rid of a lot of things, but like I said, I did buy a dresser, so hopefully that is going to, you know, get some of the, like, activewear stuff out of my closet that I usually hang. Now it's time to show you guys our new view. Come on. It's kind of rainy out right now, but this is our balcony. It is smaller than the one we have now, but I swear that apartment that we have now is like abnormally large and you guys are probably like, okay, why did you move from there to here? Our new apartment is actually a little bit closer to downtown and it's above the river, so a little less traffic that we have to deal with. And here is our new view. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing my empty apartment tour. I'm so excited to actually get moved in and just start making this place my new home. Definitely check out Smart City Services. All the information will be in the bio and you can also follow them on Instagram and TikTok where they post all this really cool tour content. It's great to stay updated to just see what kind of deals are in your area. If you guys wanna see in the moment content around Austin, go ahead and follow me on Instagram. It's so underscore gnarly without the G and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.